Taxonomy is the system by which organisms are named and classified. Linnaeus, or Carolus Linnaeus, classified organisms into a hierarchy of taxa. Taxa is plural for group, and taxon is one group. With Linnaeus' system of taxonomic structure, he originally grouped all organisms into five kingdoms, as you see here. You might see this in old textbooks. But because bacterial cells have been found to have uniquely different origins, today there is no longer a kingdom called Monera. Instead, modern scientists now classify organisms into six kingdoms and also three domains. The six kingdoms are plant, fungi, animal, proteist, eubacteria, and archaebacteria. Okay. They also classify, modern scientists classify organisms into three domains. Let's take, for example, the grizzly bear. The grizzly bear is actually in the domain eukarya because it has, um, is made of complex organelles in its cells, um, eukaryotic cells to be precise. Its kingdom is animalia, phylum chordata, class mammalia, order carnivora, family ursidae, genus ursus, and species ursus arctos. It's important to note that as you go further up the taxonomic structure, the more general and the more organisms you'll encounter in a specific group. And the lower down you go on the taxonomic structure, the reverse is the case. It will be more specific, there will be more different groups with within, um, there will be more, excuse me, individuals within a group, but we'll, there will be less groups. So squeezing all life into these categories is pretty difficult to do. What you might be asked in, um, in school test questions, things like that, is that if two organisms are in the same family, then the question is, are they in the same order? The answer is uh, in an easy trick I use. If an organism is in the same taxon, then they are also definitely in every taxon above it. So if we're comparing organisms, that's important to note. For example, bears and humans. Bears and humans are in the same kingdom because they are all animals. They are also in the same class but, and phylum, but they are in different orders. Bears are in the carnivora order, while humans are in the primate order. Going down from there, they diverge, and they cannot have any other more specific taxa in common. But going up, if they are in the same order, then they are also in every taxa above it. So for practical purposes, how do we remember taxonomic structure? First, take a look. This is in a common mnemonic that people use, you can make up your own using the first letter of each of the taxonomic levels. For example, D, K, P, C, O, F, G, S. Domain, kingdom, phylum, class, order, family, genus, species. Dear Katie, please come over for great snacks. I've heard many alternatives starting with, you know, Dear King Philip or, um, you know, come come over for some good soup, you know, you can come up with different alternatives. Good luck.